What's up guys, Mark from Copper View Glass here. Um, just a quick video for you guys now on the, the latest uh, announcement for Call of Duty Black Ops 2. They have obviously now announced the first load of DLC content for Black Ops 2, which is going to be coming out at the end of January. Now we're going to be done, just going to be talking about the levels while we have a bit of the gameplay in the background of the new levels. Um, so let's get straight to it. The first level that we're going to be having a look at now is a level called Hydro. Now this is set in a uh, Hydro Dam in Pakistan, um, and it is a very kind of open map. There are some nice indoor corridors there if you are a guy that carries on an SMG like myself um, and there are a lot of kind of bottleneck areas where you can get hold of people now one of the main things there is now an environmental hazard in this as well um, there is kind of like a uh, water uh, kind of um, a waterway kind of thing where uh, they release the water and it's kind of going to flow out onto the uh, onto the plane and it's uh, a very dangerous place to be um, if it does get released and it happens kind of every couple of minutes in the game if you are stuck in that waterway when the water does come then you are going to die basically um, the next level that we have is uh, Grind now this is a very big change from what we've seen in Call of Duty previously um, it's a bit of a fun level basically it's set in a skate park in California um, in Venice Beach to be exact um, and it features um, a lot of kind of curved surfaces, obviously being a skate park, there's also half pipes, quarter pipes, ramps, etc. Um, not very many corners, so if you are that kind of guy that hides around a corner and then just pops out, this isn't going to be the level for you. It's going to be a very kind of run and gun map because there's not going to be that many places to hide. So that means you will have to kind of switch up your play style a bit basically. Um, the next level that we have is going to bring snow back to Call of Duty and that is going to be the downhill level, which is actually set in a ski resort. Um, and again, it's a very kind of open map. There's lots of very good vantage points for you snipers out there, who I hate, by the way. And uh, there's also um, another environmental hazard here in, in terms of the cable carts. Um, again, going up and down the mountain. Again, you can use them to hide behind and use them as cover. But again, if you do get in the way, then again, you are going to get killed, basically. Um, now, the last multiplayer map, there are four in total. This one is now called Mirage, um, and it is set in the uh, Gobi Desert. Um, and it features kind of like a very nice um, kind of Chinese kind of village basically with like huts and things like that um, but that has been a sandstorm that has gone through the town basically so there's going to be a lot of um, sand dunes where you can get up into the second floor of buildings and things so it's not just going to be going up the stairs to get into buildings anymore you'll be able to access them from multiple areas because of the sand that has risen up basically um, as with all Black Ops DLC there is obviously a uh, zombie uh, kind of expansion as well um, it's going to feature a uh, brand new level which is called Die Rise, um, which is kind of like a play on words, obviously you're going to die, and also the German word of the, so the rise, which is quite nice. Um, and it features kind of like skyscrapers and very tall buildings and things. There's a very vertical zombies level which has never really been done before. There are elevator shafts that you can fall down and things, multiple floors, uh, multiple hazards and things. Um, and uh, there's some parts of the level where you may not know which way is up or down because of the design of the levels basically, so it's going to be very hard to kind of get your head around it and also a lot of zombies to kind of uh, keep you guessing basically and um, there's also a new mode to zombies as well where you can actually play as the zombie yourself and you can have up to four players in this game mode and um, three of them are going to be zombies and one of them is going to be a human um, and basically the aim of the game is to stay alive as long as you can if you are the human now obviously your friends and things or other people you're playing with online they're going to be trying to obviously kill the human the zombie that kills the kind of human player then becomes the human player basically so it kind of keeps it going and the person at the end of the round which has the highest score uh, as a human is basically the winner so again a very nice uh, kind of play on zombies that we've not really seen before now for the first time ever in Call of Duty history um, I'm quite excited about this they're actually going to include a new weapon within the DLC there was talk of doing this with Modern Warfare 3 and also uh, the original Black Ops when that came out but nothing really came of it basically now what we're going to have here is a gun called the Peacekeeper. Um, there's not too much gameplay footage of it yet, they've just come kind of uh, showcase photos and things like that that we can look at now. Um, but it's going to be kind of a marriage between a SMG rifle and an assault rifle. So again, those people that are maybe like myself, that do like that close quarter action, but then also like the advantage of maybe getting some scope with a uh, assault rifle, this is going to be perfect for you. So obviously like I say, that is the uh, new DLC pack for Call of Duty Black Ops 2, which is going to be coming out in January. Uh, end of January, I think it's about the 28th, 29th. 
Um, I will be playing it myself. I am an Xbox guy. If you want to find my Xbox Live, it is Cab from 1989. I'll be happy to play. Now, uh, like I say, it's going to be really good when it does come out. Uh, it's going to cost about £9.99 uh, if you get it on its own, or if you do have the season pass, then it is going to be included. So, happy gaming, everybody, uh, and I will catch you in the next video.